Is that you, John? Oh, shit. Look who it is. How's it going? Uh, yeah, I didn't expect this. Well, what a nice thing. Of course, I expected you to be around there. Everyone <laughs> yeah. is. Have you uh, checked out the cars recently? Yeah, man. You know, those uh, those two ones are mine. I oh, just sold them. I'm nice. moving on to bigger and better things, man. Oh, I'm buying myself a house. Yes. I'm gonna live, settle down, man. Yeah. This life is getting to be too ridiculous for oh, me. Oh, absolutely. I just, uh, I just had a buddy get pinched, so he could definitely use your services at some point. Well, perhaps, yeah. man. I mean, I don't know. I, I think I just want to settle down. Yeah. I, I've had enough of this crazy, reckless life, honestly. Yeah, that's fair. Actually, you know what? It's kind of getting on my nerves. I mean, Mendoza keeps on reminding me over and over again about this damn loan I owe him. And he oh keeps on God. whining and whining. Speak of the devil. Hold on. Seriously? Hello? Do you want to head up to the house? Uh, yeah. Hey, I can head that way. I was just at Route 68. Um, I'm going to bring George with me if that's okay. Oh, perfect. All right, sounds okay, good. sounds good. See you in a bit. All right, bye bye. All right, well, there goes yeah, my uh, my car shopping day. Let's. Uh, he wants to meet at the house, so he said you could join if you want. But uh, yeah, why not? Yeah, let's roll. Oh my god! Oh Jesus! Stupid locals. I gotta say, man, I'm still am impressed with this car. I don't know how you pulled it oh, off. I love this car. This car's incredible. All right. Uh, yeah, man. Let me mark it real quick. Can I be honest with you? I don't feel good about this one. I mean, why is that? When does Mendoza ever invite me somewhere when it's not something bad? You know. I mean, that's fair. I agree with that. I think you know, though. Usually, he'll call me and invite me, and then when I asked if I could bring you along, he was definitely hesitant. So it's not like he was nice about inviting you along. I feel like we're on the Titanic, you know, got the American movie. Yeah, I think uh, we're all on Titanic, and we're coming for the iceberg very soon. Mm -hmm. We have to start deciding who's getting on the lifeboat and who's going to stay on until the fall. Yeah, I mean, absolutely. Absolutely, yeah, there's uh, there's a lot of shit that's been going on. And I know, you know, everybody's been a little pissy with everybody, but hopefully we can we can resolve all that. I hope so, man, I hope so. I've seen all of it, man. I've seen all of it. I've seen the crim life. I've seen the lawyer life. Yeah. I've seen the civilian life. Yeah. Well, I mean, to me, though, like, you know, like you're worried about people like Mendoza and, and, and all those different people that we run with. And the good thing is that you have these long term connections with them. And so man, I know Mendoza since out of the country. Exactly. Man. And so that's why, like, obviously you get in his face occasionally and obviously like he gets pissy, but I, I just don't ever see him doing something to you. Yeah, no, that's true. I mean, we've had we've had one incident a while ago, but yeah. it's past us, man. Yeah. Well, all right, let's go chat with. Here we are. Windows. How's it going, my friend? How's it going, sir? What's you on the right? Uh, oh, oh, just, uh, is that you under that, Oscar? Yes, sir. Jesus, I couldn't recognize you. You look like a uh, vagabond. No offense. He's been up in the mountain for a couple of days. <laughs> yeah, you look like a uh, you look like a hitchhiker in the way, man. Jeez, I might you, only get that go, chopped up. Yeah. Said, oh, oh, it's day going day? well. I was uh, I was just about to go car shop and I ran up to I ran into George up there. Yeah, I found him. I didn't. I yeah, like what your, a uh, real like coincidence. Your cigar through your oh, thank you. Yeah. I cut a little hole, so it was just perfect. Yeah, well, I've known. he's got a big mouth. No worries about that. Kind <laughs> <laughs> of like you, huh? Yeah, kind of like me. Okay, that well, they were speaking about you. You got my money for me yet? Money? Yeah. You fucking kidding me? I thought they had a longer lean, uh, you know, lean on that. I thought you were going to give me more time. I mean, it's been like three weeks, to be honest. So this is what you invite me over for, to bitch at me for not having your money, are you serious? I mean, I didn't invite you, I invited John. Yeah, well, John asked me to come with him, so it's an extension, you know? How much did I even- you know what? Fuck you. Can I hit Fuck him? you. Take your fucking money. Take your money. Take it. 
George, look, man, we 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 Only we'll, six thousand dollars. Oh yeah, that's just a bit of it. I take the rest of it too. You can kiss my ass while you're at it. I'm tired of the way you've been treating me. I thought we were friends. You treat me like this over and over. The fuck are you talking to like that? Oh, what are you gonna do? Shoot me? Yeah, as if. Look, I'm not tired of these threats, you. You motherfucker. Watch your fucking mouth. Fuck off of me, you know? Hey, do you know what? We came here, we started this as equals. Put your what fucking are gonna, hands up. What are they gonna do? Shoot me? Put your fucking hands up. Oh. It would up. Put them up, George. Oh, yeah, big man. I'm so scared. Are they gonna shoot me? Is that what's gonna happen here? Go get in, uh, go get in John's trunk, yeah? Oh, I gave you- Oh, you're taking me hostage! Are you kidding me right now? I thought we were friends. After everything that's happened, you can't get rid of me. I'm too useful. Vlad, tell me what you're, you're not Vlad. Fucking George, what are your uses? Hmm? Get you out of prison. I'm fucking up a really, really simple fucking deal. Uh, your your whole. I'll get you out of jail. You're not around when I go to the cell. It's not. You skipped out on the courts and. I mean, shit, you almost lost your DOJ license over something so dumb. Look, Mendoza. Take what do you need me to forward. do? Do I need a bag for my life? Is that what you want? No. Nope. Oh, come on, don't do this. Please. I'm trying to get out of this business, not end up in a ditch. Come on. Look, I get, I get it. You've sent your message. We're fine. All right, you can all go back over this, right? It's fine. There's no, there's no problem here. Look, <laughs> I know how long I've known you. Oh, what Shut the hell? Mouth. Come on. Oh! Oh! What the hell? You shut your fucking mouth, George. Oh. You keep talking, huh? Please, Mendoza, come on! You know, you've got such a, a big, big old mouth on you, George. You know, you, you go and you say some shit to the bosses, and you know, you act like you're still in the scene when you're a lawyer, and... You know, I just, I just don't get it. Look, at this won't happen again. We can still move past this. John! To move past. John, please tell him! Please! You got nothing to say. Oscar, you're gonna let him do this to me? You know, George... What, I've what are they to gonna do? They're gonna stop me? <laughs> uh, these guys oh. have an understanding of who the fuck does what. Come here, Oscar, right. go ahead. Get a, get a punch to his fucking uh, stomach, yeah? For what he did to you and Kimmy. Come on. Come on, Come on Oscar. Oscar, Oscar please. God, All I'm saying is, I've tried to Without protect that you. fucking aggression, Oscar, you change a man. Come on. Come on. Look, man, I've tried to fucking tell you since the beginning of time. 
keep your shit closed, you just listen to me and you still don't listen to me. Come on, I come on. I to help you for come the on, longest man. time, man. The longest time. Come on, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? So I, 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 gotta, I, I gotta walk away or I'm gonna fucking punch him, man. Come on. Guys, I, I have a question. John. Yeah. Do you think he's got a big mouth? Yup. What 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 about you? You think you think his mouth is a little too big? It's definitely more than it should be. Come on, John. Come on. Look, we're buddies, but you're not a part of this crew, man. You were the lawyer. Oh. <laughs> you knew too much. Mendoza, please. I'm sorry. You pissed off my boss. I'm sorry. What do you expect me to do? This will make it a little fucking <laughs> harder for you to talk all that <laughs> shit. What's wrong? Cat got your tongue, huh? Oh, I've been waiting for this. Back up a little bit. Goodbye, my friend. <laughs> Jesus Christ! We weren't supposed to kill him! This was a scare tactic! The fuck? Let's get the fuck out of here. the fuck? Is that George? What happened to him? He was found in a ditch over in Sandy Shores. He has his tongue cut out as well as uh, he has a slash across his eye and multiple stab wounds. He's been bleeding quite a bit. His okay. pulse is very low. Is he gonna make it? Are you fuck? Is he gonna make it? I'm not sure at this point. His pulse is extremely low at this point. It's nowhere near stable. But I'm gonna be trying my absolute Blood, damnedest. George, I want you to go out onto the street and find who the fuck did this. Don't worry, you'll get through this, man. What the fuck happened to you? I don't know. Do what you do, best. We will not stop until that fucker's found. If you fucking find it, okay? I want him in this hospital in the same condition. Let's give, let's give him some room. Let's wait outside. Good luck, George. He's the focus right now. Hey, is there a Mendoza out here? Yeah, there is. Uh, yeah, Mendoza, come back in here. Uh, medic, something talk to you. George, please. Don't do this. Time of death, 8.36. God damn it. Someone. What's going on, John? Time of death. 8.03. Damn. To Mendoza, I wish you all the best, but it's time for me to move on. 
With this money I'm giving you, I hope that you and me are square. I like being around here, but I want to settle down and move back to Russia. I wish you all the best. Live long and well, my friend. Yours. What in the fuck? First time I met him, he, uh, he got into an accident and I took him to Piltbox. And ever since then, he's called me his guardian angel. I'd like you to go and collect out your shoots if you could. Things might have been a little bit different, you know? Yeah. Alright, let's go. They're like going there to look at them. Yep. I'm tired of it, John. Yup. It, uh, not gonna say it was unwarranted. Maybe unexpected, but not unwarranted. <clears throat> May he make it to heaven 30 minutes before the devil knows he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> 